from TV City TV. Today I've got a vlog Clare Town versus Faxed Rangers at Harp Lane. Quarter past six kickoff. Bit of a strange time for a kickoff. Um, but it's midweek game. It's the quarterfinals of the Hunden Cup, which is kind of a local um, tournament that the good sides in the Cambridgeshire leagues take part in. Um, and if Clare win this, they play against Cavendish, which is literally, I could probably walk to Cavendish. Um, yeah, hopefully it should be a good match. Hopefully Clare can get the win. And I hope you enjoy the video. Here's the Clare side to face facts of this evening. In goal, number one, Richard Boyles. A back four of O'Hare, McCarthy, Krause and Wiley. Midfield three, Chinnery, Copsey and Hughes. And the front three on the left, Smithson, on the right, Fairless. And leading the line, captain, Jamie Adkin. Here we are at Harp Lane. I'm alone. Um, John's doing the dishes or something like that. Here we have a lovely evening. Um, and yeah, John is doing the dishes and he'll join me for the second half apparently. Um, and yeah, decent attendance. Claire Facts did, should be a good one. Hope you enjoy the video. Massive chance of facts within the first 40 seconds. Just arrived. Um, number five, Benny McCarthy, mistimed his header to clear it away, um, and Faxed number nine slotted it in. So John, you've been there a minute, and they've already scored. Good cross. Oh, good ball. Good. oh no. Half, half six Smithson eight. just passed it to passed it as John would say to the keeper, straight to the keeper. Um, he would have scored that any day of the week. Tom, as we know him um, from the 4 3, where he tore Jamie Paul apart the first half. Good turn. Go on, square it. Yes! Get him. It's 1 all. How is it 1 all? Um, it was. Half time, it's been. It's been poor, not going to lie. How it's 1 all. It's just ridiculous. I don't know how it's one all. Um, but anyway, it is one all. And the facts that have dominated throughout. John, what are your thoughts of the two goals that you've seen but missed 40 minutes of the half? Well, the facts of one was very well taken. Mm. Um, but we looked we looked a bit naive in our defending. Second half, that's kick off. John's staring me down like, no, John, John, what are you doing? Up here. Apparently, I need to be up here. Second half prediction, I'm going for a. Unless you want another a four, I'm going to go. I'm going to go for a five-two Faxted. Great turn by Hughes. Ah. Oh, one of Copsey's. One of Copsey's left-footed specials usually come quite close. That one. That one didn't. And fearless, uh, 34 goals for the reserves this season, I believe. The whips in the ball, and it's it's um, it's not the best. Johnny Botting, superb. They're number seven. Had acres of space, and they literally just passed it around, passed it in, basically. Mm. Two one facts is my five two prediction to them still on. Substitution for Claire. On comes Samuel Boggis. Um, have we got a bogus on the pitch now? We have a bogus. I think we stand a much better chance when we've got a bogus. Yeah. <laughs> Jack O'Hare to smash one, possibly. He's in. Go on. Go on. Oh. How has that not gone in? From Dorco. It's into Adkin. Oh. And Dorco's working his absolute socks off. Fair play to him. 
his chaffer here puts one of his corners to collect. Minimal time left now. It will, I think it will probably, it can't go to added time. It will just go straight to penalties. And it comes back out to Adkin. Good touch. Dorco monster throw come back. It's like Rory de Lap. Oh, look at that. That is, that's a thing of art. Oh. <sighs> Here's Nathan Copsey on the left. It's probably the one of the last chances here. He goes past one. Yeah! Yes! Come on! What? Oh, good. Get in, Nathan. Very good finish. Great finish, Copsey. Because they cannot play another half an hour in this. Get in. Claire all over Faxted now. It's 2 all. Um, extra time, I don't know if they can, the light is really going. Another 10 minutes of proper light, I think. And it's, uh, it's not exactly warm. To be taken by Adkin to win the match and St. Clair into the semi-finals. They've got an outfield player going goal. The keeper, literally, I can't believe I didn't get it on camera, I'm gutted. Literally, <laughs> whipped him out. Um, and I'll be gutted if Adkin doesn't score this, and I've got to score this, come on. Absolutely, I can't believe that. Literally, I, that would have been comedy gold if I got it on camera, but the keep's been sent off. Penalty to be taken by Jamie Adkin. Big moment, St. Clair into the semi finals. Yes! Get him! Come on, Jay. Great penalty. Really good penalty. I literally can't believe. He literally. Player manager Ben was on the pitch. It was mad. He literally, I can't believe I didn't get it. No, no word of like, like it was a goal kick. Smashed him at the back of the lead. Can't believe Chinnery's still on the pitch, really. Um, but yeah, hopefully he can just hold out now. Ref. You having a laugh, ref? And still going on. I don't know how this match is still being played. Here's Adkin, just corner. Corner. Show. Andre. Keep that ball. Come on. Yes. Come on, our lads. And it finished. Claire three. Faxter two. Somehow, I don't know how. Oh. One nil to Madrid. Um. But anyway, yeah. Good performance. Second half. Man, the match goes to. I'll give it to Copsy because he was superb second half. Or mm, it's between Copsy, um, O'Hare, um, Dorco worked well when he came on, and probably Adkin as well. All put in a good shift, especially in the second half. John, yeah, Boyles was superb as well. Um, kept out a few first half that kept us in it really. Um, but yeah, that's about it for the debrief. Someone bloody hell, mate! Don't give much space. If you have enjoyed the video, then please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Claire have got Cavendish in the semi-finals next, so there'll be another vlog at least. And until next time, thanks for watching.